Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Sundays with Sully. Thank you guys for tuning in, and if you haven't already, go ahead, hit the smash, like, follow, subscribe button, wherever platform it is you're watching on here, and be sure to give us a follow on YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook, at Navtronics. All right, that spiel's out of the way. What are we talking about today, guys? Today, we are talking about Vesper Marine's Cortex VHF radio. Now, before you guys tune off and tune away and go, eh, VHF radio, or hey, Sally, didn't you just do this last season like eight, ten months ago? You're right, we did. But it was a dummy unit. So we went ahead, we wanted to test this out in the real world. So we went ahead, we've got a live unit here. Game plan was to get this here in time to put it on a boat and show you guys how this all works in the real world. However, due to shipping delays, surprise, surprise, we didn't get that in time and all the boats are coming out of the drink now. So here we are, we're in the studio. We're still gonna go ahead and show you guys a lot of the cool features that are built in to this Cortex VHF radio. So it's not just a VHF before we delve any further. This is also a class B AIS radio. That means that this is going to send and receive your location to other boats and everything else as long as your MMSI number is programmed into it. Remember folks, no MMSI, no transmitting on the AIS because it doesn't know what to transmit. So this means since it is a class B AIS, it has its own standalone GPS antenna that is required for this. This also has on the back side of it here, a Wi-Fi and a cell phone antenna. So you can do an external antenna or you can do like a little rubber ducky antenna off the back. The cell phone antenna is on here because this actually is also boat monitoring. So twice a day for free, with the Vesper app, you can log in and see what's going on on board your boat. Uh, just a kind of bare minimum kind of a data set, like where your boat, what's going on, what are you monitoring, those kind of things. But twice a day, it does an update, and that is no cost to you, that's just for having this and getting it set up. The Wi-Fi that is on here, that is how all of these handsets communicate. That's also how the app goes and it communicates as well. So we've got our handsets to communicate via Wi-Fi, and we also have the app here that we can control from our phone or from our tablets here. So we've got a lot of stuff going on. Um, before I forget, with the boat monitoring, they do offer an annual subscription plan that you can do with this, and that gives you real-time vessel monitoring. That allows you everything that's on the NEMA network, that gives you the geofencing, that allows for the anchor watch. If you guys are cruisers, I know a lot of people, there seems to be an uptick in people doing the Great Loop or doing the uh, Southern Cruising from up here. You're gonna be anchoring your boat at some point in time. Uh, the peace of mind comes when you're anchoring, A, having a good anchor and being in a good anchorage, but you wanna make sure the boat's not dragging. You can set an anchor watch on this very simply, and I kinda of walk you through this here, but it comes and it'll notify you on this via Wi-Fi, but if you have the subscription-based service plan for this, it will notify you on your phone. So if you've gone into town, you're going, you know, going to get groceries, you're going out to dinner, or whatever it is, and you want to get that alert on your phone, letting you know the anchor is starting to drag. So hopefully you can tend to your boat before it becomes a bigger problem. So let's go ahead. We're going to go into the app here. And if I do my editing right, it'll show up over here. We're going to go into the anchor watch feature on here. And it's kind of handy. It says right there in the upper right-hand corner that our depth is 26 feet. So we're gonna go ahead and say we're anchoring. It's our scope is five to one and 26 feet. So we have a 170 foot circle. We can change that, we can adjust that. You'll see we're in auto mode here. So it's going to show the boat actually going outside of a range. And we're going to go ahead, we're going to get our anchor, anchor alert here momentarily. You're gonna see the screen is gonna change colors on us. And there we go, red. Anchor drag, drag alert. alert. So now we're going to get our alert. We're just going to go ahead, in this case, tell it to ignore it. And we are going to weigh anchor. And there we go. Now our anchor is off. But it's just that simple. So if you guys want to set your anchor watch and go to sleep at night, 
you can just have that peace of mind knowing this thing's going to pop up and give you an alert and it's working silently in the background without having to have all of your other you know chart plotters and other devices on because this has its own built-in gps antenna it's not relying on anything else for that uh, another great feature that's on here and it's also on the handset here is if i come into the instrument display and that is also going to be on here and we can bring up all of our instruments and it's kind of handy because again everything that is on NEMA is here and we can just scroll through if we touch this actually we have to unlock it there sorry we touch the screen and we can scroll through and we can choose whatever we want to put here in this case let's do course over ground we've got ground wind uh, let's change this over to uh, heading and over here let's make this uh, water temp so we've got you know water depth rather and uh so there we go we got water it's just that easy to change all this stuff and lock it down so you have that as well on the app so that's really pretty slick to have and available to you like i said also on the handset and this handset's really easy to use again because here i can just scroll through and i can change whatever it is i want for my information right there i can come up to the hamburger menu on the right hand side and i can just easily rotate through all the different options that are available to me and again it is just a simple vhf as well and we can go through here we've got a nice rotary knob to change channels and you want to have a preset channel maybe you're always talking on 77 with your cruising friends it's as simple as just pressing and holding and now 77 is set as a favorite preset we have our push to talk right here fits really easy in hand it's very comfortable to use like i said it is a touch screen as well we've got our volume up and down right here on this side as with all of our vhfs anymore we do have our red distress dsc button right there and again, on this screen, we're going to get our Wi-Fi signal, we're going to get our anchor drag, we're going to get our GPS heading, we're going to get all that information right on here. And that can be with a corded connection, like I said, that's what this is, and that's just simply to power this, or cordless with a charging cradle. It's so very easy to add. Uh, as I mentioned, you can do up to 10 of these on there. Um, NEMA 2000, Class B AIS, has a GPS antenna, no need for a second unit VHF and or AIS. Uh, vessel monitoring. You also have the app capability. It's just very user friendly and a lot of stuff packed into it. And it's available right now. There's no delays. There's no waiting. You don't have to wait four or five, six months for this thing. These are available right now in inventory, in stock as they are coming over. So I think that's it, guys. This was kind of a long one. But there was a lot to unpack on this. Sorry we couldn't be out in the water and show you guys the real world AIS, but you get the gist of everything else and how this thing is working. And I think it's a pretty slick product in that respect. So, you know, who knows? Maybe come spring we'll revisit it. We'll get out in the water with this installed and show you guys some of the additional features and just how it works in the real world for you guys. So, till then. That's all I got, guys. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you for giving us a follow. As always, stay tuned. Give us a follow. Uh, what is it? Instagram, Facebook, um, YouTube, at Navtronics. I don't know what we got in store for next week, but tune in, find out, and we'll go from there, guys. Peace.